Good evening, I'm Scott Hennessy. And I'm Beth Farnsworth. Locals who drove above the fog got to see the northern lights over the weekend, and there's still a chance to see it, apparently. That's good news. Yeah. Tracy Lair joins us live from Westmont College, where she spoke to a longtime physics professor. Tracy, you're at the observatory, but you don't need an observatory to see it. No, we talked to Professor Ken Kilstrom, and we always meet him at the observatory, and he says you want to be to the north in the northern mountains behind me. Uh, you can see the right direction. And he got a lot of calls over the weekend. One of them came from a Cold Spring Elementary teacher who wanted to, to know where to go. And she actually took some high school kids up on Camino Cielo. And he told her about the right time. You want to get away from city lights above the fog. And he really wasn't sure what she would see. But then he saw her photos and was inspired to go too. And I'm thinking, oh, well, that's really exciting, but I'm really thinking there's no way. And then she sends me that spectacular picture. And then by the time we got up, you know, you could still see the northern lights, but it was more kind of not very colorful. So it wasn't very dramatic, but at least we can say we saw the northern lights. Now we talked to viewers who were sharing photos. Some took photos off Highway 33 in Ventura County, others off the 154, but and they really think there's another chance. The window of opportunity is around 9 to 2 a.m., so there's still hope. And Professor Kilstrom just says it's so exciting. Uh, you can tell he's like a kid in a candy store talking about science. He's a professor of physics uh, with a Ph.D. in physics, and just the whole science of the magnetic field and what you're seeing and the images but he also said the photos do appear better than the naked eye because when it's dark out people tend to see in black and white and we'll be sharing your photos and hearing some reaction to them tonight on the news reporting live at Westmont College I'm News Channel reporter Tracy Lair